What is going on today, guys? Today we are back out on the boat in the middle of the woods here and we are gonna be doing some more magnet fishing. Now we have been all up and down this river, you guys, in our kayaks and we have found some pretty crazy stuff. And there is just no telling what else could be in here. So we're not gonna waste any time. We're gonna get right down to it, start dipping these magnets. We're gonna kind of just float down the river and see what we can come up with. Oh, hey, hey, what is this that uh, we got one? <laughs> you already found yeah, one? I think this is the, the log dog. Yep. What was that, so, your second throw? Second throw. What oh, the yeah, heck, man? Sure, bro. All right, guys, today I got my large 360 degree magnet with me. We're going to start off on this river bend. We're just going to use the trolling motor, kind of float down the river, and we're going to see if we can come up with anything today. Or maybe the uh, the bottom side of it there, a little piece. Some other odd. A lot of. Uh, Oh, look at this. Check this out, you guys. First throw of the day here for me. Looks like I got a couple of scrap pieces and stuff, but first of all, that is definitely the handle off of maybe a drawer oh, yeah. or something yeah, for yeah. Sure. sure. Look at right. that. But look, look at this too. What the heck that, do you yeah. think that is? That's kind of weird looking. A metal flag. Something with a little like canister on the end. It almost looks like it was supposed to be a cylinder. Oh, snare goes. I think it just landed in my Mountain Dew. I ain't drinking that no more. Well, I don't know what that was, you guys, but we just smushed it into a bunch of pieces there. Looked like a container or something. There's like, what is that? Some kind of like substance in there. Oh no. Then we had some kind of ring off of who knows what and just a bunch of scrap pieces. Whoa, yo. It's like uh You aren't kidding you guys. Look at this thing. That's definitely that. a glass tube. Do you think that that's sealed where this is like a substance different than the water? Oh no, no yo. What is that? That's the weird. sparkles in there, man. It's sparkly. Look at this oh, thing Alex just caught that. you guys. Dude that is. I mean that's a straight up like Maybe not a syringe, but a vial of like something. And you can see the substance in there is like, look at that, you guys. There's definitely something in there. Oh my gosh, man. A virus. A virus. Who knows what that is? It's like chunky. Some antibodies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Some end your bodies. Holy cow. Look at that one, you guys. Now I caught medial horseshoe. This thing's like super tiny and brittle looking. Looks like I can just snap this thing. That one is super tiny though, like compared to the one Alex found. Look at mine fits right inside there. As many as we've already found, I can't imagine how many could still be down there. It's like messed up just trying to think about it. And it's not in any one section of this river, you guys. It's all the way up and down. Pretty cool. Yeah. You caught a tree. Whoa. Oh, what's that though? It's a, uh, I don't know. Oh, like a chair stand or maybe I'm not. Kind of thinking. Maybe like a sign stand. <laughs> These clouds are looking mighty cloudy here. I hope it doesn't rain. I think I got something. Feels a little heavier. Ooh, what is this? Oh, look at this. First of all, I caught some kind of ring for something. And if you look, look at like right here. Is that part of a spoke or something? So is this maybe like a, I don't know, it really doesn't feel gushy like rubber or nothing. Huh, some kind of ring, but it almost looks like the rim of something. Maybe a tiny wagon wheel or something. I'd be willing to bet that's exactly what that one is. And other than that. Oh, dude, heck yeah. Oh! Oh, no oh, way! Dude, this is like a pretty darn good shape. Heck yeah! It's like shovel head, man. Missing a whole handle though, that's oh, crazy. Man, right. Other than that, you guys, uh, looks like just a bunch of scrap here, a couple little nail bits. I don't know what you want to think of this one. It almost looks like this is the foot or stand for something here. I don't know what the heck we got there. Whoa. Ooh, clicking and sticking. But did we get the chicken? I feel something. Oh, I think we got the chicken. What is this? What is that? That's pulling weird, dude. What in the world? Rope, string, string. Oh, yeah. oh yo. 
I don't know what that is, first of all, but ooh, there's a couple things. There's a handle or something on there, too. Oh, hold on, dude. First of all, what the heck is on the end of this? Come on. Nice and easy, because I don't know, whatever it is, I don't want to pull too hard and have it, like, come off. Come here. Maybe if we get above it, it should come out. I don't know. What the heck is that? This this rope is no. Well, I don't know if I did whatever it was. It's not. Yeah. Yeah. What the heck? And it looks like it did snap too. Yeah. It kind of looks like it. What the heck is on the end of there, man? You guys, and look at this. Look at what it's tied to. What the heck is going on there? It's just like some kind of metal. Looks like something with gears or teeth on there that's kind of funky looking but obviously you can tell this was like hand tied on there i don't know you guys that's a weird one and other than a bunch of debris you guys i did see this handle on there check this one out yo flathead screwdriver and look at all the rust on there oh my gosh this thing's been down there since before i was even born I think I got something. The very next throw, yep. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. I'm hitting some more. Oh, now we're heavy. Whoa, what is this? Yeah, that's pretty heavy, you guys. What do we got? Ooh, what do we got here, man? First of all, look at this. That's like a little, a little mini ladder piece for like a toy set or something. Like. What else could that be? Truck. Yeah, maybe a fire truck ladder for like a toy. I don't know. Absolutely. That's cool. Dude. Well, that's a pretty cool looking piece, you guys. I don't know what to think of that other than it really does look like some kind of ladder or something. And we have the old two for one on there. What do you think that is? A lock. Oh, nice. You got a lock? Yeah. An old looking one? Yeah, super old. Kind of does look old. There is some, does that say RAM? Design on there? Oh yeah, look at some that. RAM? Some kind of design. What the heck do you guys think this thing is here? I don't know. I, at first I thought maybe like an oil filter or something, but no, it's like a, it's totally hollow in here. It looks like it's filled with dirt or something, but there's like a hole in the sides here i don't know some kind of metal cover for something maybe that's a weird it's looking a thing it's a piston head. a piston yeah it's a piston head a piston a head piston head yes absolutely what the heck for so what like for an engine oh really yeah and how long do you think that one's been down there super cool you guys am i on something here i just can't tell with all these rocks down there the rock or not no dude i got something oh that's heavy yo oh my that's not gonna come up is it it's gonna no that's gonna slide off i almost guarantee it come here oh my gosh it's coming up no nah this ain't gonna come up i guarantee you it's gonna slip off before i even get it up i don't know what this is i don't know what it is oh my gosh that's heavy Whoa, whoa, yeah, look at, look at this, you guys. There's like a, what do you call that? Like some kind of shaft on there. Like it might attach to something. That sucker is super heavy though. Holy smokes. Something with the shaft on there, the old triangle looking something. Oh, bro, got me a wheel. Oh, that's a wheel. That, see, that's a full intact wheel. I thought I caught the rim of a wheel earlier. Yeah, right here. I think that's the rim and oh, of like one of those. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Kind of okay, okay. looks like it. Look, it's got the old rubber still on there. No bro. kidding. Holy cow. Know, the old wagon wheel. It's got to be for a wagon. What right? No kidding. Yeah. Check that one out, you guys. Alex just pulled up this wagon wheel here and it's still got like all the rubber intact. That's wild. But it looks pretty much similar to this little rim of what I thought was a wheel that I caught earlier. Something here. A little bit of weight on there. 
Oh yeah. Ooh. Hey! Whoa, no way. Look at what this is. Look at I can see like purple in the bottom of there. Dude, we got us a little pot. Check that thing out, you guys. That is pretty cool, you guys. You can see a loop on there where there should have been a handle or something. That's crazy, man. I don't see any writing on there or anything. So who knows how old this thing is. Can you imagine back in the day, somebody probably cooked some chicken noodle soup in there. Some rib of soup. Of course, I forget to hit the record button on my GoPro. Switched out my battery. And now, literally, I think I got something. My very first throw after switching the battery out. Oh, there is something on there. What the heck do I got here? Whoa, look at that little thing, you guys. What the heck do you guys think that one is, man? I don't know, two little cutouts in there. I don't know, like it would lock into place on something. That is a weird looking something there, you guys. Not much to go off of on that piece. All right, guys, moving and grooving, poking around a little bit. That is the name of the game. We're gonna do some tossing around this bridge here. We're gonna see if we can find anything else. I am pulling us right to something here. Is that even, am I, is that magnetic or what am I on here? Some kind of rock? No, that's heavy, dude. Oh, lift it up. I got something real heavy here, guys. Yep, here we go. Right smack dab. Oh, is it a sign? Bro, it is. Yes, dude. No way! You guys, I love finding signs. Let's say no parking at any time. Dude, that's a keeper for sure, man. Nice find. Wow. You guys, that is super cool, man. Check that. Oh, look at look at whose claw and head I see sticking off the top. We got some little Franken. What you doing in there, guy? You guys, I cannot get Frankie out of there, man. He is he is straight up stuck in the tube, yo. Well, I'm just gonna have to let this thing sit out and wait till uh, Frankie crawls out of there, I guess. Keep my eye open for him. Unbelievable, you guys, what a find. There he is, ha ha, gotcha, buddy. Look at, what you doing in there, guy? Check it out, you guys. Frankie fell out of the tube and if you would like to pick up some Frankie merch, the link is down in the description. <laughs> Go on! Ooh, almost sent myself back too. Oh, look what I got, man. A little C-clip? Yeah, look at that, you guys. I caught me a little clip. Check that one out. Oh, look at, no way. No it way. still it's turns. Still Holy cow. They must have greased that sucker up real good. Super cool. And obviously, by the way, it still spins. You can still use this. Like with very minimal cleanup. Unreal, super cool, man. What is that, the old three inch? Say, oh, three incher. Something just clicked. Oh, uh, come with me, come with me. Stay. It's coming. Nope, it's gonna get stuck. Oh, yep, something happened. Oh, it's still on, dude. Yes, I got something. What the heck do I got? Yo, something, something. Uh, can't really tell. Hold on a second, you guys. Let me get in the light over here. Can't really tell what the heck. Couple things. No, look it. First of all, whoa. What the? Okay, little ugly scrap piece here, first of all. But look at, you guys look, I can see the little football. Oh wait, these are connected? Whoa, what the heck? Whoa. At first I seen the little football shape and I thought this was another one of them sad irons that we typically find, the old school iron. But uh, then I saw this, thought it was separate, like a weight or something. But no, you guys, they are literally tied together. What do you think that is? That's really weird. What the heck do you guys think that is? Super crazy looking. Oh, I just sucked something out of the mud so hard. Dude, seriously, here we go. Here it comes. Oh, this is really heavy. This is really, really heavy. 
Whoa. Whoa. <gasps> no. Ooh. Did you not find one of these here? Yeah, right. I right. swear you did. It looks like a grappling hook right. or like a homemade type one, but look at you guys. I, what the heck? It looks like they had wire tied on there. Like a like a cord. What the heck? You guys, I don't know what to think of this thing, but obviously, I mean, it looks like some kind of anchor type grappling hook because it's got the hooks on there. But uh, that is not much for hooks. I mean, you're not, you're not really hooking much. Just looking at this thing, it's like no wonder you got it snagged at the bottom of the river, man. I don't know what you're tr you'd be trying to do with this. I don't know. You're definitely stopping the boat with this thing, but you ain't getting it back. Oh, what the heck, you found this? What is this? A steel handle with the foam grip, and that is literally all it is. <laughs> what the heck? Steel handle with foam grip. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's something here under the bridge. Oh my gosh, that's, and it's coming up. Shut up. Wow, that's heavy too. Here we go. Another heavy something under the bridge, you guys. What is this one gonna be? Whoa, whoa. What the? Okay, now we're getting real weird here. What the heck, dude? And it's got a rope tied to it. Look at it. Nothing on the other end. What the heck? That's like an anchor type rope, ain't it? That's a big old thick rope. And look at, we caught the old prison bars. What in the heck do you think is going on here? Yeah, it's like just some kind of frame type piece with the old prison bars on there, you guys. That's really weird. What do you think of that one? I mean, you can't tell me somebody's using this as an anchor. Really? I mean, maybe. If that's all you got, I don't know. I just, I just, that's crazy looking. The fish were using that down there as their prison. It's a jailbreak down there. Oh, no way. Look at what it is. Smack dab under the bridge, you guys. You gotta be kidding me. Wow. <laughs> Rocks or what? Uh oh. That's not moving. Wow, that dude, you guys, that slapped so hard. Now it's gone. What the heck was that? My magnet pulled so hard to click onto that, it almost ripped it out of my hand. Oh, well, I got something here. Don't think it was whatever I clicked onto before, but I got something. Hey, look at this. Like hey. I would, no, I think I've seen these before. I think I've actually caught them. I think this is like a screen printing roller oh, or something yeah, like that. Sure. Yeah, you guys, this is like soft and cushiony here and you can see like the teeth on the ends of these roller things here. So you can tell, I mean, this must turn to turn this piece here. And I don't know if they would put ink on there and, and, and yeah, you know, like, yeah print newspapers or who knows what. The old ink roller or something. Pretty cool. I think I landed right on something. No kidding, you guys. Oh, smacking something else hard. Wow, what the, what's going on here? That's not, whoa, 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 whoa. Jeez. Uh, uh, uh. Something is like really stuck in the mud, you guys. I'm trying to work this sucker out of there. Give me a second here. Oh, oh. I don't want to move. My goodness. Oh, oh. oh no, it just doesn't. Huh, but I think I have something. Yeah, I can still feel some weight, so there might be something blocking. Yeah, what do we got here? Was that a, dude. That's another one of them rollers. Yeah, no kidding. Look at you guys. That's so weird, man. You can tell this thing's definitely squishy. It's like a rubber, like a rubber roller. Except for this one, if you look on the ends, it actually doesn't have the twisty gear pieces like this other one does. Huh, that is super funky, man. I'm pulling something. This is heavy too. Everything I'm finding today is just so heavy. 
We're finding some pretty cool stuff today, you guys. Ooh, ooh, what is that? Hold on. What the heck is this, yo? Looks like just some scrap bits, maybe a you know, piece of piping or something on there. But look at this thing. What the heck? That's like, look at this one. This is the king's crown. Oh, no, kidding, what the heck is that? I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know. It's really weird. It looks like, uh, again, some uh, like kind some of teeth or gears on there, there right? I don't know, man. Really weird, you guys. Heck yeah, man. I think I'm pulling something again. It's literally like every throw in here for me right now. Wow. And it's heavy stuff. Every throw, I'm telling you. I got something. Uh-oh. Did I just hit a rock or what? Uh-oh. Now we ain't moving. Yeah, we're going nowhere. Oh. oh, dude, it's like, it's pulling out of the mud. Here it comes. I got it. Yup. Shut up. What's this? Whatever this is, the sucker's been in the mud for a while. Oh, oh, ooh. Couple things that look so da, 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 don't you go anywhere. What is that, yo? Hold on, grab that. What the heck is that? Looks like we got another piece of pipe, but there's also something else sticking off of the side. Wow, that's, well, that was what was heavy what for sure. Heck? But look at this on here, you guys. So I don't know if this is like some kind of handle here oh, yeah, or something, good. but look at there's like a it's like a pitchfork really type deal. Yeah, like queer poker. <laughs> I don't know. That's crazy looking. And then look at this one that I saved that almost fell back in. You guys, there's like some grooves on there. It almost looks like a chain bit. And it does. You're kind of right. It almost looks like like a chainsaw teeth almost. Like a... That, that is really weird. As you can tell, that sun is starting to go down pretty quick. Yet again, you guys, another super successful day. We filled that cart way over the top and again with some super cool stuff. There is absolutely no telling what else is out there and we will definitely be back. Today, Owen and I are back out on the boat. If you guys would like to check out his channel, I will leave that link down in the description. Now, today we're back out here once again. We're going to be doing some more magnet fishing at one of the juiciest spots I think we've ever hit. Right now, we're going to start poking around right in front of this auto parts. What is this? Bumper to bumper auto parts specialist. We're going to see what we can find and then I'm going to pull the anchor out. We're just going to float down river and we're going to keep dipping. I have my large 300 and 60 degree magnet with me and Owen is going to be throwing his medium 360 degree magnet. So far I haven't even started tossing yet you guys. Owen is on a roll. Looks like he got himself some kind of pin here and part of the old plumbing pipe or something here. Looks like he got himself a little bit of cash money scrap pipe. We do look like we're spinning. What the heck's going on here? Did I just land on something? I think I might have. I'll look at yours and see what you got. Yeah, I got something here. My second throw of the day to the towards the bridge here. What the heck do we got? I'll show my camera with the crack. Oh my god, guys! Don't, looks like I got me the old plumbing piece. Well, check that one out, you guys. Me and Owen are going matching sets here on the plumbing pipes. Nothing too crazy. Let's keep tossing. Did I just catch an uh, anchor on like probably like my four throws? You think I... you got an anchor? Oh yeah, this sucker looks heavy, huh? Oh, we got a couple things on there. Pull her out. Let's see what you got. <gasps> oh yeah, a couple things, dude. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh, sucker fell. Look at this, man. What, what the heck I, do you think you got here? It almost looks like a pizza roller, doesn't it? Yep. I think you could cut a pizza with that thing. What the heck is that? <laughs> that is super weird looking. Something with a little wheel or something on the end of there. Pretty cool. And you have this thing here. This kind of just looks like some kind of wow. funky looking ring. It's a bracelet. Here you go. Put that one on. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, it fits perfect. You're blanging. <laughs> <laughs> it's like super good. And you have a lot of money, right? Yeah, and we're good money finds. Oh. Oh, I got it. I got something. Something heavy? You what sure are pulling on something, huh? Oh, what is this? Oh, I don't want to use this. Whoa, buddy. What is that? Oh, okay. Can you get it? Holy cow. You need help? 
Hold on, I'll get it for you. Is there any Frank in your closet? Whoa. There's no Frank in the closet. <laughs> I don't see no Frank in the closet in there, no. Like, if I was a crayfish, I would stay in there Heck for my yeah, it's a crayfish hotel if I've ever seen one. That is super cool, you guys. This, this is definitely like half of some kind of pot or something, man. You can still see some of the handles on here, and this handle here even has like some white and blue paint still showing. And look at that, look at the bottom. You can still see two of the, like the stand pieces. That is pretty I cool, you guys. Oh, I'm flinging mud everywhere, holy smokes. We're getting messy today. The old blue and white pot, nice find, buddy. Cleaning up the river one toss at a time, searching for some goodies. Oh, I think I just might have clicked on something, but we got a boat flying at us here. Gotta steer us and pull us up at the same time. Oh, hey. Whoa, look at that. Whoa, some kind of tube. Oh no, I'm dripping all over the electrical solar box. That ain't good. But look at this thing, you guys. Some kind of tube of something. And if you look at this piece here, you can see threads on there. So it's almost like this is supposed to be turnable. And it is. Whoa, look at whoa oh what the you can just pull this right out of here what the heck it is just some kind of tube of something what the heck you guys think was in there man seems like nothing but mud now you know push pop tube oh look at what i just found you guys <laughs> I found me a little fishing lure and it's giving me flashbacks to the old rip and wrap place. Super cool, you guys. Heck yeah, man. And look at this one. No hooks on that thing at all. A little bit of gunk on there, but nothing that can't be cleaned up. The old rattler. Ooh, use all your strength. Ooh, look at that thing, man. That's kind of cool looking. Look at this thing, man. What do you think that is? Some kind of, it looks like some kind of bolt going through here, but there's like, I don't know, some kind of ring or bracket on there. That's kind of cool looking. Yeah, I don't know what that Check is. Check that thing out. That sucker is pretty heavy, huh? That's a funky one. Oh, I'm grabbing something here close to shore we are not far from shore here can't even be that deep in here can it oh what happened oh no it's still on there yeah what do i got here whoa yo whoa dude oh hold on is that like the peg off of a motorcycle oh, yeah it is i think it is that's not off of like a bike no, no, look at like, yeah, like you'd be riding a motorcycle. Brr, 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 brr. No, could Dad, there be a whole motorcycle Dad, you, in here? Dad, you see those bubbles coming up? Yeah. Those are, that's something big like right this. You think there's a motorcycle in there or what? Yeah, I think I just got the end pin. Holy cow. If there is, there's certainly no way we'd be able to pull something like that out with just these magnets. We would need grappling hooks and probably definitely more people for sure. Super cool, you guys. Let's keep tossing and see what else we can find. I almost feel like I'm dragging something from way downtown here oh i think we are what could this be and i'm seeing some bubbles can you, you guys see those bubbles coming up here we are dragging something for show sure. what could this one be that's got some weight to it Ooh. oh yeah here oh wait a minute oh wait what okay. yeah hold on though at first i thought this was like a wrench or something and then I seen part of the chain. I don't know what the heck was going on here, but look at, this is definitely like connected. So I don't know if this was maybe part of something bigger. Huh, some kind of hook with the chain on there. All right, you guys, we floated down river a little bit here. Now we're at a section of river that we've really only hit, I wanna say once, maybe twice, and it was only for like an hour total. Now there is a trot line. You can see that white sign on the tree, and there's also another one marked over here. So we gotta kinda avoid those. But I'm not sure what used to go on in this area back in the day. You can kinda see some older style looking houses over here. There's a business and a bar over here, but right now this kinda just looks like an empty parking lot. 
lot. But the amount of stuff we have been finding in here leads me to believe there used to be something in this parking lot. Let's keep tossing around here, see what else we can find. I think I got something. No kidding. Literally my first throw in here, dude. Oh, it's like heavy too. What the heck is this? He's so slow. Already, seriously. Whoa. Whoa. What the heck do we got here? Looks like a, oh, hold on. Oh, dude, I thought that was like the gun hand, a, a handle of a gun at first. I don't know what the heck that is. Almost looks like maybe there's just a bunch of rust here, but maybe this is supposed to be the handle for something. Maybe some kind of shovel, who knows? But for real, you guys, look at all the rust caked on this thing. It, it, that is just super old. And almost everything that we've been finding in this area looks just like this. I don't know what that one is, but we also had a couple other things this one here looks like some kind of big old pin or some kind of big old bolt with the square head nothing too fancy and we had a little bit of chain bit here check that out you guys again just tons of rust caked on there i would really like to know how long this stuff has been sitting down there and what was this thing attached to need some help do I have something? It sure feels like you do. Holy cow. Feels like extra heavy for this little magnet. What the heck is this? It's coming up. I, I, you're not going to be able to lift this by yourself, buddy. I got it. Hold on. What could this be? I feel like I'm hitting the bottom of the boat with something. Oh, there it goes. Something just came off. Oh, there's still something on it. Oh, look at that. What the heck you think that one is, man? Something with a loop or a ring on there. Oh, look at that. What the heck? Is that some kind of old school like fishing oh, pole? Like a, like a rod holder. A clamp to oh, it, ain't a clamp. it kinda? That is a rod holder. It's probably from up there. It kinda looks like it. Yeah, you could you set your rod. Like that. Yeah, right. You know, this is kinda hard to do with us standing on the same corner of the boat here. We got a big boat and we're standing on the same same section. <laughs> Whatever. It, it works, huh? You got something? I got something heavy too, actually. Yeah, At the same time, we doubled up or what? What do you got? Oh, I do got something heavy. Hold on. Uh, like oh, a couple things. Oh, yo. Dude, what is what that? Is that? What is that? No kidding. What is that? What is that? A Canon power shot. Dude, it's an old camera. Look at this. What the heck, yo? You guys, that is a super crazy find, man. Look at the old PowerShot 500 Canon. How old is that thing? And what kind of pictures you think are on there? It's almost a little bit creepy, though, because it makes you wonder why would somebody throw a camera in the river? And you guys, look at this. Besides that camera, we had two other things on there. This one just looks like some kind of ugly old ring or something, some kind of brace. Stick your arm in that one, the old arm bracelet. <laughs> and then look at this thing almost looks like some kind of Big boat. like a wheel hub cap or something not a hub cap but like the the wheel hub if you know what i'm talking about now we're starting to lay into some funky stuff you guys i'm telling you something about this shoreline here there is some stuff in here you stuck or what yeah. doesn't feel stuck it's moving i think you got something on there though you definitely do dude what do you got here? Yeah. Whoa, yo. <laughs> this looks like some kind of canister or something. Do you hear that? I do. Shut up, I do. Yeah. You think it's going to explode? Yeah. <laughs> 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 it is. I can still hear it. Hold on. Listen quiet. There's a big tractor in the background or something, but this thing's definitely like leaking air or something still which right. it would be weird because think of how long it's been underwater wouldn't it have been leaking air the whole time well what the heck do you guys think that one is that owen just found definitely some kind of canister and it's definitely like leaking air as we speak i don't know if this is some kind of nozzle up here it almost looks like there was supposed to be maybe some kind of gauge or dial in there who really knows What just happened? You made it. Oh no, dude. No. What? What just literally happened? I still have my magnet. Are you kidding me? No. Way. It just flew off? It had to have 
Oh my gosh, what the heck, yo? In all my years doing this, I've never had that happen. Not even one time. I'm guessing this lock nut thing here must have came loose so that this was open. And the magnet was definitely on there when I tossed it, so it must have hit the bottom and maybe unhooked. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, so we know for a fact that magnet is somewhere in this vicinity. But I think I do have a backup in here. Yep, I do. I have one extra magnet. You gotta be kidding me. How lucky is that? All right, you guys, I got me a backup magnet here. We're gonna start tossing around. Obviously, we're gonna probably find some more stuff, but I wanna find my magnet, man. I think I got it. Dad, I, think got, I think I got your magnet back. Let's see. Keep pulling. I see. Nah, I'm just kidding. No way. No way. <laughs> I got something here. I don't have your magnet. Oh, yo. Yeah, what is it? Yeah, what the heck is that? Hold up. That's no know? magnet, but yo. Oh, don't touch that. Give me that. Give me that. Oh, my gosh, Owen. Jeez, no, that is not a cigarette with no gloves on your hands either. What the heck, yo? Oh, yo. Oh, my gosh. I think we might have to call the police. Don't say nothing too loud. Yes, we're calling the police. We are definitely calling the police, you guys. Oh, I'm afraid to even touch that bag. Nope, I ain't touching that. I see needles, look. I'm gonna get out of the sunlight here. Look it, Owen just picked up a needle. I, I opened this bag I found, you guys, look. One, two, three, four, I mean, there's gotta be. Oh, yo, hold up. That's crazy, dude. Call the police right now. Hold on, buddy. What the heck, and I don't know there's like something else wrapped up, look it. Look at you guys, there's something wrapped in a package Daddy. with with rope on there, yo. Daddy. What? Dai, I think if you if you if you really if you really stuck one of those into your body, then I think uh, someone was trying to kill a bunch of people. We are getting out here. Dude, oh I can't believe I just found that. I'm afraid to touch it because I do not want to get poked. And I can there's like 20 needles sticking out of this thing. I don't want to get poked. Yeah, we don't want to touch these, dude. We're gonna, and I, I don't know, I'm not just gonna dispose of this in the garbage or something. Like, we got a call about that, yo. This is one of the craziest things I, I think I've ever did. seen. I never did. Look at you guys, look. You can just see all the needles sticking out of there. I'm like shaking a little bit. There's something in bags too. There's something wrapped in bags. Like, they look like pills maybe. I don't know. I don't know, man. But on top of it all, you can see the needles. There's also something wrapped up in a package with like a, with a rope, dude. Look at that. Oh, oh man, you guys, Bro, this ain't cool. Don't touch this, buddy. Look, you can see like residue in there. Yeah, oh gosh. You guys, I think the only right thing to do is to call the non-emergency number and let them know what we found. Cause I, honestly, I don't even know if I don't call them, I don't even know how to dispose of that. That's like, that's like hazardous waste. You can't just throw that in the garbage or something. Hi, um, I was just doing some magnet fishing uh, from my boat here and I pulled up what looks to be a drug bag with there's got to be over a hundred needles in this thing like they look like hypodermic they're like orange tips and stuff I don't know I, I don't even want to touch it and there's something magnetic in there too because I picked it up so I don't know what else is in there okay, and your name I'll put in are you able to wait until an officer Yep. There. Yep. No problem. All right. I will have them on their way shortly. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. Watch out, buddy. Watch out. Oh my gosh, man. That's, I just, that's messed up. That is so messed up. Don't even go near it. There's multiple bags and they're wrapped up in a, like a rope and it looks like some needles loose. Like maybe those are full bags with needles. That is crazy. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, it looks like a whole bunch of them in there. I found them right behind that uh, that bar, there's right on the wolf right there by that concrete wall back there. And I don't know, it looks like there's bags in there wrapped up in something too. It got me all freaked out. I don't even want to touch it. I don't know what it is. What's up, buddy? You got a GoPro too? Yeah, I'm getting them started. Something magnetic and I don't know if them needles are magnetic. Maybe if there's a whole bunch of them, maybe, I don't know. Thanks, guys. 
Yeah, yeah no Stick problem. I didn't want to touch it. I didn't want to deal with it. I yeah. figured, I don't know if you're just going to throw it in a dumpster or whatever, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't want to touch it. So. Yeah, no problem. All right, cool. Thank you. Good. Yep. Good. Have a good one. Thanks. You guys, I almost don't even have any words for what we just found. It was hard to tell what was all really in that thing, but it was a giant bag wrapped up with a rope, and, and there was at least... 20 plus needles in there. So I don't know what they're gonna do with it. I don't know what it is. All they said was, thanks, have a nice day. Just absolutely unbelievable, you guys. Today we are back out on the boat and we are gonna be doing some more magnet fishing at a spot where last time we came here, we found a giant drug bag. I'm talking, that thing was absolutely massive. We even had to call the police and everything. Today we're gonna be searching the exact same section of area that we found it in. There is just no telling what could be in here. If you remember last time in this spot, not only did we find a massive drug bag, but I actually lost lost my magnet here as well. Something happened with the clip, it came undone, and my magnet should be sitting somewhere in this area. So today, not only are we gonna try to see what we can find, but hopefully, fingers crossed, we can come up with my magnet too. We're gonna get right down to it, start tossing around, and let's see what we can find here today. I know my magnet's in here somewhere. It didn't go flying off the hook when I let go, and I, I, I didn't see a sploosh or nothing, so it's gotta, it had to have just come unhooked at the bottom of the river here. Am I like on something heavy already? First throw, yeah, something super, whoa, whoa, actually really heavy, hold on a second. Oh, hold on. Here we go. Already, first something of the day, this is like super heavy. Is this even gonna come up? No. Yeah, whoa, what is this? Yo. What the heck is this? Oh, that's gonna, oh my gosh, it's gonna break my back. I'm not even kidding. Hold on a second, hold on a sec. Is this part of it? It is. Oh my gosh. Yo, what is this? <laughs> First throw of the day. Whoa. What is that, yo? My magnet's not sticking to the side. Is that a piece of concrete? That definitely is a piece of concrete with a piece of like rebar or something sticking out of there. Holy cow, you guys, I thought we caught a big old box or something. I thought this whole thing was like a big old metal box. Heck no! We cost you a homemade anchor if you want it to be. Honestly, I'm just gonna sink that thing. Well, I don't know what the heck that thing was, but there was more concrete on there than there even was metal. So that thing's probably better off a fish habitat. I feel like I'm pulling on like some string or maybe rope, fishing line. Is it still on there or what? Felt some stick. <laughs> Shut up, yo. No. As soon as I said, what the? What are the odds, dude? I said it feels like I'm pulling on some string or like a some maybe some fishing line. Bingo! We cost the old cash money fishing pole. What the heck brand do you think that one is? I can't even tell. It looks like this whole pole is still intact. Oh, some of the rings are oh fixed her right up. Nope, didn't even snap, got her straight. You guys. This pole looks like it could still be fished with. You have got to be kidding me, man. And it's the old right-hander. Oh my gosh, it's like frozen right solid. You probably need a new reel on there. But honestly, I bet you this fishing pole is still good yet. And literally, this is my second throw in the river here, you guys. Already off to a hot start. What do we catch there, the old fuzzball? You ain't eating that one for dinner. Oh, we got the big one. Holy cow, man, it's so hot out here. I wore the sun shirt so I wouldn't get burnt, but it's like, I mean, I almost can't even breathe. The air is so... Uh. Ooh, what is that all of a sudden? What's this one here? Come on, bucko. Wow, there is some pretty heavy stuff in here, man. Um, whoa. What the? Um, whoa. It just keeps coming. Yo, what the heck is that? Is that like some kind of fencing, like a gate maybe? Holy smokes, look at this thing, dude. At first it looked like just a big old piece of piping or plumbing, but uh, no, what the heck do you think that is? Some kind of big old frame piece off of something. My goodness, that thing's gonna take up the whole back of the truck. Magnet, oh magnet. 
where could you be? I just want to find you because I want you here with me. I got something. Oh, buddy. Oh, what the, yo. What the heck is this? Um, oh, that's long, long. But you guys, look at this end here. This is definitely like mechanical, or not mechanical, electrical, because look at, you can see the wires hanging off of there. What the heck do you think that one is? Got the old electrical box on there. Looks like one big old long electrical piece. Yup, and look at that one there. You can see the wires coming out of that end. We could wire us up a house. Oh, we got some weight. Ooh, what is that? Why does it look so wobbly? What the heck is that? Again, looks like some kind of square frame piece off of something. Who knows what? You guys, there is some old stuff in here, man. You can tell just taking one look at that. Look at what, like, what is that? You got algae growing on top of the rust. That is insane. Another scrap piece off of something. Something just snapped to it hard. That could be the magnet. Please be. No, no magnet, you guys. But whoa, what the heck is this one? Ow, cha. But check this thing out, you guys. You can see little gears on there. And I wanna say we definitely found one of these here last time. And it's got threads, so it screws onto something for sure. Who knows what that disc looking thing is? The old rotatable something. Bingo, look at what's on the bottom of there, man. Tons of debris and scrap on there. Some kind of like half pipe piece or something. But look at that fishing lure, man. I love finding fishing lures. These are cold, hard cash money. That one there definitely needs some new hooks, but it still rattles. Nothing wrong with that at all. Put some new hooks on there and you're going fishing. Oh, slap to something. And that's coming up. Shut up, it is. It's like I stuck to something, then it popped off, and I restuck it to something else. What is this, dude? The, okay, now the pipes are just getting bigger. That's the old crayfish hotel, buddy. If there's not a crayfish in there, come on, Frankie. You in there? Huh? I think we got a clear pipe, but I dumped out a bunch of stuff here. Unless there's one in there. No, just some rocks and mud. How the heck is there not a Frankie living in this pipe, man? There's no way. That's where I'd be living if I was a Frankie. Ooh, I grabbed something here, guys. Oh no, what happened? I think I still got, I definitely still got part of it. But something fell off there. Ooh. Oh, look at that, you guys. That one's got some teeth on there for sure. Again, looks like we caught a, some kind of gear type piece, but uh, that one's got way bigger gears and way bigger teeth than the other piece that we found. All kinds of different geared pieces in here, you guys. What do you think something like this is coming off of? Again, super duper old with all that rust caked on there. You ain't turning nothing no more with that gear. Super cool though. It really makes me wonder what are these coming off of? Huh? Oh, all of a sudden, is that a rock or something though? Oh no. Oh, whatever this is, you guys, that we sucked that out of the mud. I could feel it. Yeah, whatever this is. Oh, here we go. Oh, look at this. Dude, I thought we were catching parts of like some kind of basket before. Look at, we got a little clam guy in there. Nobody's home. But look at this basket, you guys. Oh my gosh, what is that? The old, the old milk carton basket or whatever you call it from back in the day. This is how you get your milk delivered. I don't know, man. That thing is super old looking. There's definitely handles on here. You can see one handle here and one handle on this side. Super crazy looking. Unreal, man. 
And we had this. Oh, yo, look at, there's a key on there. What the heck? What do you think that key goes to? Maybe just one of the locks or something? Or is that maybe, it almost looks like an old GM key or something. Like an old car key or maybe a house key. I don't know, man. And there was this thing on there too. I don't know what to think of that. At first I thought it was another lock because I saw this thing. But no, it's like a, some kind of spring type deal with the, what you call it on there? I don't know about that one. Boing, boing. Oh, got something. If it's gonna stay. Yeah. What do we got this time? Whoa, whoa, what the, yo, what the heck is that? Um, it looks like metal combined with some wood here. You can see there's like a metal frame piece at the top and there's like wood built into it. I don't know, what the heck do you guys think that is? Was there maybe wheels on the end here? I don't know. That's really hard to tell. Wow. I really don't know, dude. Super cool looking though. And based on like the way this metal looks, this thing looks really old. Who knows what the heck that came off of? That's a lander right on something. Yeah. What is that? Ooh, right up on the shore there too. Oh my. That is pretty heavy. Buster. Oh, whoa, you guys, that is so weird. Oh, and it stinks too. That's gotta be algae on there. I bet you that's not even good to breathe in. Ugh. Oh, look it. Is that a string tied on there? Hand tied string? Oh, maybe not. The old industrial size bowl. Oh man, I don't, I don't even wanna hold on to that. That's seriously, that algae, that ugh, it just smells like it can't be good to breathe in, yuck. There's a lot of heavy things in here. Oh my god. Oh, what is that? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, dude. Yeah. You really? Hey, that's another one of them exact. Oh, look at what's on there. Shut up. No way. Look at attached to the old crayfish hotel, which I don't think anybody's even home. We caught us a pair of pliers. Look at that one, you guys. That one's got the black rubber grips on the handle, but my goodness has that been down there for a while. There has not been a single thing that we've pulled out of here yet that isn't just absolutely caked in rust. That would take some major TLC um, to apparently get working again, maybe not. As I was saying, this thing would probably take some major work to get working again. I literally bust the rust right off and look at like what minus that rust on there this thing is still movable that is unreal you guys that just goes to show you right there what a little bit of grease will do look at that you guys we already got this cart just about full and we haven't even gone far at all I'm talking like maybe 30 feet on this shoreline there's got to be tons of stuff left in here There's like something in the mud here. Does that want to actually come up? Dude, it is. Oh, what is this? That took a minute to wiggle out of the mud there. Nice and slow with this thing. What the heck is that? Ooh, look at what's sticking off on the side, you guys. No way. We got some big old D battery. Bzz, bzz, the old dirt still. But what the heck is this thing, man? Doesn't really look like nothing too fancy, the old ugly something. We sure are finding a whole lot of ugly looking pieces in here, huh? I don't know. Oh, yo, what is that? Something here. That's pulling weird, like real weird. What the heck is this? Oh, what the heck is that? It's like stuck in the mud or something? Oh, look. Yeah, I don't know what that is. 
Oh my gosh, you guys, this is another one of them things with the hand tied string on there. And you know what I figured out these are? This is something for a trot line. Apparently this is supposed to like hold it down in the water like a weight kinda. And then they have a bunch of different hooks on here that you can see, one, two, and I think in Wisconsin you can have up to three hooks. And then you basically just let this thing sit out in the water and you check it I think once a day. And if you got fish on there, you scored. We've had to found over 20 different random metal pieces with the string tied to it. People must be trot line fishing in here like crazy. And look at what else we had on there, you guys. We has the old pair of scissors. You definitely ain't cut nothing with that one no more. We cost the old snippers. Some we're grabbing on to. I think it wants to come up. Yeah. What is this? Oh, what the heck is that? Look at all the holes in that thing. What in the world do you guys think of that? Some kind of massive strainer? No, that is a weird one. Maybe something for like plants or something where the water is supposed to drain through the bottom. I don't have a clue. Whatever it is, again, super old. Look at it, just busting chunks right off of that thing. You guys, at first I thought this was just an ugly piece of stick metal. Wasn't even gonna tell you about it. But look at this end here. This is definitely like piece of a chain link fence. You can tell. What the heck? Not much left of that thing. But I'd be willing to bet the rest of it is still down there. Oh, no, -uh. really? I thought I grabbed another log or something because I didn't even feel it click. Dude, I got another one of them big old basket things. It's like the exact same thing. Got the handles on there and everything, man. What do you think they were using these for? Because today is not our first time finding these things. There's got to be a bunch of them down there. Wow. Oh, no, wait a minute. There was something on there. Why do I do that? I don't feel anything and then I don't even look and throw it right back in. Yes, this is the thing that I literally, I pulled up nothing on the last throw or so I thought, and I didn't even really look. I just tossed it back in. But check that one out, you guys. Another gear tight piece. And that one is super duper tiny compared to the other ones we were finding. I wonder what these are coming off of. Pretty cool, man. Brr, brr, brr. Holy cow, man, what a day. It really didn't take long at all. I think we were out there for maybe three, four hours and we filled that cart right to the top. We were even stacking metal on the boat itself. I am absolutely cooked, you guys. We didn't end up finding my magnet today, which sucks, but I know it's gotta still be in there along with who knows what else. It is absolutely gorgeous out here today. We are back out on the boat. Today, Alex is out here with me. And today we're gonna be magnet fishing a section of river here where just a couple videos ago, I actually found a massive drug bag. Now we've only returned here one other time since then. And we found some more pretty cool stuff, you guys, but I guarantee you there's gotta be tons left. Today, I have my large 2,100 pound magnet magnet with me. This sucker is an absolute pancake. But if you remember two videos ago here, I actually lost my 360 degree magnet. That sucker came flinging right off of the clip. So we got to make sure that this thing is tight. We're just going to start tossing the shoreline here and we're going to see what we can find today. Every pull with this thing feels like you're pulling up a truck. Oh, 
No way, it's a two for one too. You guys, look at that, man. I don't know exactly what number throw this is, but I don't think we reached 10 throws yet. And I already caught me a little bitty fishing lure and an old pliers. Now that's what I'm talking about. Super old looking lure, man. Look at that, you can rub the gunk right off of there. And the old rusty pliers, dude. No way, look at it. Oh, look at it. What? I can like wipe it right down to the shiny metal. Yeah, well, wow. Brand, brand new store bought pliers right nice. there for you, bucko. We cost the old two for one. What do you got? A bar stool. Oh, yeah. No kidding. Look at that. <laughs> Look at this flipping thing, you guys. He caught himself the old bar stool. Yeah, I don't... Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. We are smacking on something here. Yep. What do you think this one is? Oh, that one's decent. That's got some decent weight. Oh, what the? Oh, 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 don't fall off of there. Whoa, what the heck is this? <laughs> yeah, look at that. It's like some kind of frame of something, you guys. What the heck do you think that is? The old medicine cabinet mirror. I don't know. We cost the old two piece or something with the glass in it there. I don't know. I'm here all of a sudden. I'm gonna go real slow. That clicked really weird. What the heck? What is this? Uh, what the heck is that? The old crayfish hotel? I think so, and nobody's home. Every time we pull up the old crayfish hotel, nobody's home. They must be at the hotel, motel, holiday inn. Just the old scrap pipe. Whoa, I like hit something already. I like it when that happens. Uh-oh. Come here. No. What is going on? Hold on a second. It's like something is stuck in the mud here. Oh, oh, oh. We got to play the wiggle game. Oh, it's working. Shut up. I got it. I love it when that happens. What do we got here? Stuck in the mud. Was that a sign, maybe? Oh, man, we got bamboozled. I thought we were about to pull up a sign, you guys. I love finding signs. Unfortunately, we just got us the old T-post. A little bit of T-post money. We'll take her. Oh, we got us something. Yes, nice and easy. We're coming up on this wall over here. We're kind of just bouncing back and forth, up and down with the trolling motor. Here we go. Yeah, something. Oh, look what it is, dude. Yeah. I always can tell what these are every time because they look exactly the same. They're always shaped like a football. You guys, we caught us another one of them old sad irons. Back in the day, they would have to set this thing on something to heat it up, and then that's how you would iron your clothes. Now that's a super cool piece, man. We have found so many of these things along this entire river here. Some still have the handle on there. This one obviously doesn't. What do you think the age on that sucker is? So you can imagine back in the day somebody was probably ironing their clothes in one of these houses and they tossed this sucker out in the back super cool boink i think we're on something nice and easy yeah that's coming with you guys very next throw here what do we got? Oh, mangled up mess of something. Right off the old back stairs here of this house, it, this kind of looks like a piece of a bike frame or something almost. Boy, if that's what that is, that bike's gotta be about 100 years old. Let's keep tossing and see what else we can find in here. Ooh, I'm grabbing something right over the top of where you just grabbed something. 
I got something here, you guys. Oh, yeah, what's this? Oh, hold on, yo. What the? Whoa, what the heck is that? It's like a mixer or something, some sort of a drill piece. Oh yeah, it kind of does look like some sort of mixer with maybe just a rock stuck on there. Yeah. You guys, I don't know what to think of that thing. You can see it's got like little, what you call it, blades hanging off of there and maybe like a, that goes on to something. Maybe that is some kind of mixer, I don't know. Definitely looks like it came off of something. Check that out, bro. Check this thing out that Alex just found, you guys. It's like... It's like some kind of metal bar here, but it's got like copper wire wrapped all up on there. That is super strange looking. Maybe something electrical? Who really knows? What do you think that is? <gasps> oh, I didn't even feel anything. Yo! Dude, what is this? What? It's like some, it's like some kind of stand or something. What do you think that is? At first, I thought this was like a soap tray or something from back hey, in the day. It's a mirror for like a truck or something. Like, like a an old truck. Oh, maybe. Like an old, and the mirror popped out. You think? Yeah, huh? Holy cow, like you that. guys! What do you think that one is? That's a super cool piece. I want to know what that is. I don't see no writing or nothing on there. Heck yeah, you guys! I love finding super cool, unique stuff like this. It really makes you wonder where did this come from or what does it go to wow it drops off quick in here holy smokes which makes you wonder if maybe there's more stuff out a little farther not so close to shore in this spot here because it does get so deep so fast everything anything that gets tossed in short probably rolls down right down that hill yep right here yeah, we got something. What is this one behind the old staircase, Cathedral King's Castle house here? What do we got this time? Whoa, 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 whoa. Yo, we caught the the prison bar. Yeah, no way, dude. It, maybe it is like a like a cow's uh, pasture door or whatever you call those. What the heck, man? What do you guys think that is? Or maybe like the wall of like an old school trailer or something? Maybe not. I don't know. That's crazy, man. I don't know what that thing is. Big old long frame looking piece of something. Holy cow. Ooh, hitting on something. A little bit of action down there. A little bit of action, Jackson. I think we do got something. We do, we do. What do she do? What the heck do we got here? Oh, you guys, I know what this is right away because again, we have found tons of these back here on this river. We got us the old stove damper or whatever that thing's called. And I forget exactly what it does. Something with like you turn this and you can adjust the heat or something. I'm not really sure. We probably found like 20 of these things along this river here. And we also had some other stuff on there. A lot of nails, a lot of debris and stuff. But this thing here, what is that? Oh. I think this is one of them uh, animal traps. The old foot trap. Yep, look at you can kind of see part of like the chain on there, or maybe that's not what that is. But you can see the pressure plate right here. Kind of hard to tell because of all the rust, but this thing here should open up. And that's the pressure plate where when you step on it, you get snapped. Again, this is not the first one of these that I've found along this river. They must have been doing some hunting and trapping back in the day. Is that wheels on there? Oh, that's, that's like a hinge. A yeah, for a huh? Hinge. That's a better word. Oh, yeah, you can see the handle. handle for it, what that's the heck? Super cool. Wow, at first I thought these were wheels, you guys, but no, there's, it's like a hinge here, and this is like a door handle. What do you think that's off of? That is like super heavy, like cast iron. You found the old safe door from the 50s. <laughs> yeah, right. What the heck, man? <laughs> Definitely some kind of door, maybe off an old stove. Who knows? Oh, 
Oh, that's something. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. What is this? Oh, yo. What the heck is that? Um, some kind of great looking piece. I don't know, man. You can see there's grates going across this way. And then if you flip it over, the grates are going up and down. I got something, bro. Oh yeah, look at that. We are slamming it in it's here all a little, of a sudden. A small bumper. Like a mini bumper. That's literally what yeah. I was thinking. What in the world? A little goat cart bumper, bro. <laughs> wow, that's cool. Yeah. What the heck is that floating on her over there? Oh, it is too. Oh, what the? It's a squirrel. Nah, uh Look at that, you guys. No, that's 100% a squirrel. I don't even know if I can show that on camera. What the heck? Just floating down the river, poor guy. Probably lost his life chasing the nut. You guys, could this maybe be some kind of uh, like heater vent? Like something that would sit in the floor of like an older type house. And maybe somewhere on here you could adjust the, the way the vents go. Again, super, super old looking. There's even algae growing on there. Look at that. Found me one of those, uh, Another rollers. roller. Yeah, Holy yeah, cow. Cool. How many did you find the last time? I think we found three. two or three yeah. and we thought they were print in, uh, like printing rollers, but somebody in the comments a said it's a washboard roller. Oh, I grabbed something. Ooh, here we go. What the heck is that? Some kind of big old ring. Check that out. It almost looks like there's gears on there, kind of. You know, bang some of that off. There's nothing hard enough in here to bang it on. Check this out, you guys. The piece I just pulled up almost looks like it has gears on it, kind of like this thing that Alex just pulled up here. If you look, it looks like some kind of building used to maybe hang over the water here because there's a lot of concrete falling down. This looks like a pretty juicy area. We cost the ring and the gear. Ooh, dragging something. Not only is there this building or whatever this used to be, but there is a bar right here as well, you guys. This area feels pretty juicy to me, man. Heck yeah, we got something. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think that is. Oh, whoa, yo. Look at this. At first I thought it was just some kind of plumbing, but I was gonna say, yeah, isn't that some kind of like manifold. engine piece or something? What? Check this thing out, you guys. Alex says this is an exhaust manifold. What the? First I thought it was like the old plumbing piece, but now you can tell the way these uh, pipes are coming out of there. That's definitely something different. Was this building maybe a car shop back in the day? Who really knows? <laughs> Heck yeah, you guys. I'm liking this spot right off the bat. First couple throws. Oh, I just slapped something. Either I'm not getting that back or I'm not getting that back, I don't think. Oh no, here he comes. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, what is that? Oh, whoa, hold on a second. Looks like just some kind of metal bracket on there. I'm not sure what that is, but look at this. There's some kind of knob on there, some kind of dial. Is that a dipstick? I don't think so, because it's got an arrow on the top okay. there. Sure. Is that maybe some kind of old stove switch or something, okay. you guys? What the? Or maybe an old microwave. Definitely a knob off of something. Reboo, reboo. Oh, I think I got something again, man. Wow, I can't like not find anything in here. It's like every throw. Ooh, couple things, you guys. No way. I got another nice. pair of pliers. That's my second pair of pliers now. And that one there is not coming loose. Ooh. What the world is that? It's like a come along or something, bro. Oh yeah, like, like a crank. Like yeah, it does look like a or handle. A lever, dude. It's like the throttle off the Titanic, dude. Maybe that is off a boat. <laughs> yeah, Holy cow, that looks I crazy. I don't know, you guys. Maybe there's supposed to be more of these wooden things coming off of here. And this is like some kind of old rim. The old horse and buggy. Huh. Oh, look what's on there. What? 
I can see it. You still don't see it? Oh, a wrench. A wrench. It took a minute. That's definitely a wrench, though. It's like a two-ended. This is a, a half-inch drive, it looks like. So you could put it on like a nut, put your ratchet on there, and then you could really crank on this. Really? Back. Like kind of what it looks like, doesn't it? Yeah, that's Looked definitely like a square, right. Yeah, yeah. kind of like a half-inch square. That's cool. That was sort of a cover. Little, uh, little metal ice cream calling out at this point. I'm dragging something. What is this? Ooh, dude, I got one. Really? Look at it. Cost a little bit of good luck. Look at this cart, man. Just plunk full. And look at the rest of this stuff on here, you guys. Look. What is that? It's like a it's like a shank, dude. Maybe they used this in a bar fight and got tossed off the bar. I don't know, you guys. It almost looks like some kind of axle though or something. Like a I don't really know. Like maybe a wheel could go on there. I guess it's kind of Hard to tell, really. And look at this thing, hey. I think this is one of them pipes that came off of our exhaust manifold thing, like right here. Or maybe not. Huh. Maybe that's not what that is. Or maybe it is. I don't know, you guys. Pretty weird. Ooh, I stuck me a little something. It's, it's, it's literally every throw in here, you guys. And this is heavy. Huh? We are pulling some funky stuff out of here. We already got this cart stacked right full and we are still pulling stuff out. Whoa, 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 whoa. what the heck was that, yo? But whoa, oh, bro, oh my goodness. Look at this. Is that like an old, uh, oh, that's what I was gonna say, like an old paper cutter. You put a piece of paper in there and ch -ch -ch. or is this something like off an old well where you use this to pump water? Could that be what that is? Holy cow, you guys, check that out. Unreal. You got something? Yeah, I got something too. Felt it. Doubled up. In the world. I think that's two separate pieces, just Ooh. uh mangled like a Ooh. maybe a Dude. or something. Oh, yeah, you know what that. this yeah, is? Yeah. Hey! We found one of these before, and I thought it was like, remember we were joking, it was like a medicine cabinet uh, mirror or something, oh, yeah, yeah. and it looks yeah. like it folds open. Yeah. This one has part of the, like the fencing That's on here, whatever this is. The, the TV dinner tray. The, yeah. <laughs> this looks like some part of a basket or something, you guys. Not much left of that thing, though. Yo, milk cartons. Ooh, I'm dragging something. Yeah, here we go. What is this? What the heck is that? Looks like some kind of little teeny tiny pipe on that end. Nothing too fancy. But look at this thing. What the? What is that? I thought that was a wrench like welded to the... To it the almost air does air look air like air it. Air I don't know what the heck that is. No huh. Some kind of something. I think I got something again. It's literally every throw. There's so much stuff in here. It's ridiculous. Yeah, here we go again. Wow. This one's pretty heavy. Is that another one of them things I just found? Dude, it is. It's literally the exact same thing that I just pulled out. Look at, what the heck are these things, man? Two mystery looking pieces, huh? The reindeer. I know what this is. <laughs> I got something again, man. I can't not find anything. Holy cow. Is that another one? No, what is that? Whoa. What the heck is that? Look at this, you guys. Looks like you put a pin through there or something. And same thing with this end. Maybe you could put a pin through there. What the heck you think? Some kind of rod something that looks like it'll go under the bottom of a vehicle. I don't know. The old something shaft. Maybe for a steering shaft? I don't know. I'd like a big cargo truck. It's mine now. Oh, no. <laughs> Ooh, look at this one. Caught me the old boomerang. And look at that. There's some kind of green thing. No way. You know what these are? 
These are connects. You ever yeah. played with those? How's that even in there? That's plastic. Must got pinched. That's crazy. We could build us a house. Oh, look at this, you guys. I didn't really think there was much on there, but look at this thing. I don't know what to think of that. You can see some wood on this side, so it almost looks like it went on something and maybe this is some kind of handle. I'll fight you. The old homemade brass knuckles. I think the whole engine is right here, dude. I'm serious. I'm dead serious. It's not moving. It's not moving at all. Ah! Oh, they got, dude. What? Nah. -uh. What is that? Yo. I don't know, doesn't that look like a coin slot or something? Kind of, yeah. I don't know what to think of that. I feel like I pulled it off of something. Almost looks like a wheel or something there. I can't, it's really hard to tell. Whatever this is, definitely looks like it broke off of something there. Whoever gets the coolest thing, you ain't gonna find nothing. I'm gonna find a shotgun right here, ready? Oh, I am dragging something. Last throw of the day. What's she gonna be? Something heavy too. Oof, duh. Yeah, what is this? Oh, yo. What the? Whoa, whoa. what is that one? Is that a sign? Oh, that's a signpost. And you have something else on there. What is that? It looks like a massive flashlight. It's a torch, dude. It is, dude. Holy cow, let me see that. Is that like an old flashlight? No. I think that is, huh? Is there a sign on there? Bum, 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 bum. There it is. Bingo. <laughs> Holy smokes, that's an old one, dude. Like the vinyl on it's starting to bubble and it's all like starting to peel off there. You'd have to like take a... I think it's beyond restoration. I don't know if you're gonna be able to tell. You don't think so? You guys, check out this sign that Alex just found here. It's definitely starting to peel. You can see the paint peeling. I don't know if you're gonna be able to tell what that one is, man. Holy cow, that's definitely an old one. What the heck do you guys think this thing is? It almost looks like maybe there's a couple holes in the top there, but there's like a rounded bubble under there. What does that go over the top of? Huh? That is a really weird looking one. That is like solid cast iron though. There is so much stuff in there. You guys check out this piece here that we thought was uh, like a water pump or something like that. I'm actually loading up the truck right now. And check this out. I see some uh, writing on there. I don't know what this says. SW Venable. So maybe we can do some Google searching and figure out what this thing actually is. We got an absolutely gorgeous day. It's only eight o'clock in the morning. And today we're gonna be doing some more magnet fishing right behind this old bar that we've been hitting in my previous videos. Now, if you guys have been following me, you'll know we have been pulling some seriously crazy stuff out of this area. And we've even had to call the police. Least. There is literally no telling what the heck we're gonna find here. All right, guys, we are back out behind the bar here. Today, I got my large 360 degree magnet with me. We still have not figured out what this building is here, but you can see there's torn down pillars. So to me, it looks like there was some kind of building maybe overhanging on the water. I don't know. Let's get right down to it, start tossing, and see what we can find here today. Look at this, you guys. I almost wasn't even gonna, I, I mean, I wasn't gonna show you guys this at all, but look at, where'd he go? There he is. It's a little Frankie up in there. Look at that, look at him in there. He, <laughs> that was his tent, yep, he was tented up in there. What you doing, guy? Go on. That 
That's got to be something right there, for sure. Oh yeah, a little something we're pulling on. What the heck is this? Here you guys, bunch of debris again. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on a second. Look at this too, you guys. That is definitely like part of a fork or maybe a spoon or something. That sucker looks ancient though. There's no prongs on there and definitely no spoon head. You ain't eating nothing with that one. But this thing here, I don't know what to think of that. I, at first I almost thought it was like a wrench or something, but uh, no, some kind of broken piece off of something. Nothing fancy. Oh, what the Whoa. Oh, dude, oh! Some, uh, a folding chair. dude, you got a couple things. And then, um, what the heck is this? Looks like a window. It's a rake. It's a rake. Oh, yeah. It's missing yeah, the rake the part. Yeah, there. dude. Every single one of them. <laughs> <shot> <laughs> right there. That's, That's crazy. Right one sit in that thing. It'll be your last sit. A prank chair. A prank chair. <laughs> Here we go. What am I dragging? Hold on. I'm not, I don't want to drag it across the bottom. I'm going to lift it straight up. Here we go. Ooh, this one's actually kind of heavy. What in the world is this? Um, You guys, oh, wait a minute. You know what I think this is? I can already tell. Hold on. You guys, look at this. I'm pretty sure this is like a sledgehammer or something. It almost looks like like the ends are rounded here, like they've been smashed on. And like that's where your handle would go. And look at what Alex just found. He found himself an actual hammerhead. Huh. Now it kind of looks like a... Very, very little bit. I am definitely dragging something here, you guys. And again, quite a bit of weight. Oh yeah, dude. Oh, it's like twirling. That's usually a good sign. Oh, yo, look at what I just found, man. Look at the size of this ax head. Check this ax out, you guys. Got a little piece of glass stuck to that thing. How long do you think that one was down there? And if you guys remember from previous videos, we find all kinds of log dogs and logging spikes in this area. And speaking of which, right here, Alex got one right here I didn't even know he found. You can see it's pointed there. They would stick these into the logs and they would tie ropes around it. That is super cool, man. This thing's gotta be over a hundred years old. Unreal. Real. Look at what Alex just found here. A big old anchor, the old roll off. What is this? Probably a, maybe a 15, 10. No, maybe not even a 15. This is probably a, like a 10 pounder, honestly. Still got a little bit of the rope attached. That's a $20 find all day. And then look at this thing he found with it, you guys. I don't know what the heck this is. Looks like some kind of lid piece or something. It's got like a like a nozzle on there almost. I don't know what you want to think of that. Almost looks like it would go over the top of a can or something. Ooh, I just definitely landed on something. The heck is this? Of course, now it feels like I came off or maybe not. Something going on down here. What's it gonna be? Oh, something just fell off, dude. I don't know what that was. I'll never see that again. Oh, as soon as I do that, I literally landed right back down on top of something. Yup. Oh, that's heavy. That's not the same thing. Yo, you got something heavy too? Oh my gosh. Whoa. Look at that. But hold on, hold on. I got something big, something heavy too. Oh my gosh. Yo, at first I thought this was just a piece of pipe, but look at the tip of this thing, you guys. This is 100% a window weight. And by far, this is the biggest one I have ever seen before. Wow, look at that thing. Oh my God, I'm a super baby Frankies. Holy cow, hold on, let me get a video of that. What the? No, we lost them. Way to go, Frankie. Look at you guys. Two little baby Frankies. There's one right there. I've never seen them that small. Get on. And then look at, look at this one. That is so teeny tiny. That's like a, he was born yesterday. He can't even see yet. Come on, buddy. He's gonna climb off a cliff. I got him. Here we go. Right off the end of this bar stairs here 
Oh yeah, we're definitely clicking some stuff here, you guys. We're clicking the chicken. Oh yeah, we got a little, a little something there. Whoa, what the heck is this? Hey, no, is this literally not the exact same type of thing you just found? Yeah, you guys, so literally Alex found one of these, now I just found one, and if you look, it almost just looks like some kind of pipe piece or something, nothing too fancy, but this lever here looks like this would swivel and maybe close over the top of this hole here. So I don't know what the heck do you think that is? That is really weird. I've never seen nothing like that, but uh, now we got two of them from this area. Oh, yo, what the heck is this? Is that like a like a bird talons or something off of some kind of statue maybe? What the heck is this? Whatever this is, it looks like it was attached to something. Definitely broke off, you guys. I don't know, maybe the stand for something? Oh, Shut up, for the, shut for up, the wind, dude. no, heck yeah. dude. Oh my gosh, there it is. Is that a little 38, you think? What the heck, heck yeah, man? <laughs> the is that first a, one of the oh year. Oh my the gosh. First one of the year. We're uh, mid-summer, so I was uh, getting juked on the guns this year, but here we go, you guys. What do you think that is, dude? Look at how old it is. All the rust and stuff yeah. on there. Oh yeah, my fire God. On there. Bro, what the you heck, little, yo? Uh, a little iron sight. Yeah, there. no kidding. Unbelievable, you guys. Look at this gun Alex just found. And if you've seen any of my previous videos from this area, I want to say maybe a year ago now, we found a couple guns right off of this dock. So I'd be willing to bet there might even be some more in here. <laughs> Oh, look at that, you guys. I've seen a little color on there, but we got a little bottom of a can, maybe the old can of beans, who knows? But check it out, I caught me the old Bic lighter, and didn't you catch one too? Alex caught me the old red Bic lighter, now I caught me the purple. And judging by all that gunk on there, that sucker's been down there for quite a while. You ain't lighting up nothing with that one. Oh, I snagged me something here. That kind of stuck weird. Oh, what is that there? A little bit of scrap, but yo, is that, oh, dude, what the? No, oh, that's cool. You guys, look at what this says on there. First, I thought this was like a shotgun bullet or something. Oh, wait, no, what does that say? United States Tire Co. What? I don't know exactly what this says. Something about pressure gauge manufactured by something Sun Schrader Sun Inc. in New York. Keeping your tires inflated to 20 pounds to the inch. Super cool, you guys. got some weight to it oh don't that's gonna fall off what is this hold on i got it i got it yo whoa i knew that kind of looked funky look it it's a giant piece of wood with part of a metal bracket on there what do you think that's for maybe part of a like a horse or one of them stands that you work on i don't really know that thing sure does look old though the old petrified wood <laughs> What the heck is that? I think I landed right on something. Oh yeah, hold on. Whoa, dude. I'm like pulling it. We're gonna dock ourselves. What is going on? Mm. That's like, what the? Wow, I don't know. That ain't moving. Mm. No. Holy cow, not at all. Nope. Oh, maybe it is. Dude, it is moving. That should be falling off though. 
I must be wrapped up in there, yo. Oh my gosh, what is this? Whoa, what the heck is that? I can't even like, you're gonna have to help me. There it goes, oh my gosh. Oh. You know what that is? That's one of them seawalls. Yeah. Well, what the heck, there, there isn't even any over here. That's really weird. That is pushing like 80 pounds per hour. I know, that thing is super heavy. Holy smokes, you guys. I guarantee you, this is some kind of giant like seawall section because you can see like the connector pieces here where it would connect to another one and this is actually a super small section definitely nothing too fancy on that one you guys but boy that is a heavy chunk of cash money holy smokes you guys check out this one that alex found it almost looks like some kind of jack stand you can see like the notches up here at the top where it would lock in holy smokes i don't know if this is maybe the part where you put it in and crank it however that works super cool you guys and definitely super old you guys, look at this big old roller that Alex found. We found a couple in here before, and usually they have like gears on the end so that they can turn. At first we thought it was some kind of printing press like ink roller, but now from reading your comments, we know it's some kind of washboard roller or something. That is super crazy if you look here. It looks like paint almost, dude, because look at, yeah, you can like wipe this off of there. That is weird, I don't know what to think of that. Oh, look at you guys, couple things in there. I almost just dropped this glass shard in there, but I snatched it. And again, almost wasn't even gonna show you guys because really it just looks like a couple nails and a bunch of scrap pieces. But look at this here. Oh, and this too, no kidding, man. We found us a teeny tiny file. Look at the size of that one. That's a, that's a palm file. What the heck you filing with that one? Fingernails, he says, maybe, I don't know. But you guys, look at this uh, wired thing here. It almost looks, yeah, like there's maybe copper wire or like some kind of coil wire wrapped around what looks like a bolt almost. What do you think that thing is? The electrical something. I think I just ripped something out of the mud. Sure felt like it. I thought it was going to pop off, but it kind of came with. Oh, yeah, you guys. Oh, look at that. At first, I thought this was just a washer or something, but no, the closer you look, there's definitely teeth on that bad boy. What the heck? Is this some kind of gear because of the teeth or they're like at an angle? So I don't know. Is that maybe some kind of weird cutting blade maybe for, i don't know i have no clue there is some pretty cool stuff coming out of here you guys and again we already have this cart just about full hey look at that what do you think that maybe goes on there and turns that i don't know uh -huh, we could be on to something oh what the i slapped right to something Hold on. Oh, Buster Jones, what's this? Wow, I don't know if that's even gonna be ours. I think that might be stuck at the bottom of the river, whatever the heck that is. Oh, or maybe not, hold on. This is kind of moving. Oh, yo, what is this? Oh! Oh, shut up. Oh, stop, 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 stop. Oh, 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 I can't get it, I can't get it. I got it. Oh, dude. Whoa. Oh, yo, that thing. Oh my God, hold on. Oh, we're gonna put a hole in the side of the boat yet. You guys, check out this thing. Honestly, I gotta sit down to look at it because it's so dang heavy. I don't even know how the magnet picked this thing up. These magnets are absolute monsters, man. Now, if you look really closely on this thing, again, you guys, there looks like more teeth or gears or something on here. It's like a big old massive drum and it's got a back to it. I don't know, man. 
That is super funky looking. I don't know what to think of this thing, you guys, but whoo, that sucker's heavy, yo. Ooh, I slapped me right onto something. Now we're getting hot. We're like back to back in here. Oh, of course we come off. Oh, 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 we grabbed something else. Oh, this is heavy too, dude. Man, killing it all of a sudden in here with the heavy stuff. What do we got here? Oh, yo, what the? This is one of them shish kebab looking things and I'm pretty sure, what is this, a camshaft? <laughs> yes. With the beef and the potatoes. And the beef and the potatoes. Look at, you got your carrots on there. Kind of. Brrr. Wow, you guys, look at that. This is the old camshaft, and I think I found one of these before, but uh, the last one I found was like half the size, so it was like it was broke off. And you guys, no kidding. Look what the heck else is on here. We got us another one of them funky covers with the four prongs on there. Unreal, you guys. We got to be getting close to like 10 of these suckers in this area by now. Just tons of them. Oh yeah, that's great. I'm trying to catch, I'm trying to catch me and Alex. Oh, I got something too. Oh, I got something heavy. Dude, I got something extremely heavy again. What is up with the heavy stuff? Hold on, we're gonna tip the boat, dude. Like legit, we're gonna tip the boat. Hold on, hold on. Step to the other side for a sec. Oh, dude, what the? Oh, is this like an anvil? Is that what you call those? Oh, maybe not, it kind of looks like it, dude. Oh, maybe. You guys, look at this flipping thing. I don't know what to think of this. I've never seen nothing like that before. If you look real close on the inside, there's like some kind of pipes. You can see the threads. I don't know, you guys. This is crazy looking. I don't know what to think of this thing, though, dude. It's got the big old, like, bolts on the side. I don't know, man. What the heck? I can't even lift it up, dude. It's too heavy. This boat is leaning, dude. I gotta stand on the other side. Lost it. Maybe I'll go right over it. Or maybe not. I got something here. Yeah, there's something here, super heavy. I might have what you just had. Yep, here it is. What do we got here? Whoa. Yo. What the? Hold on a second. This thing's got a hinge to it. Let me get the magnet off. First of all, you can see the hinge on there. Something shiny, definitely some shiny on there, but what the heck do you think that is? Oh yeah, if you look at this end too, this end also has like a hinge to it. I don't know what to think of this, you guys. Yeah, look at this, definitely snapped right here. So whatever it was, it's supposed to be all one piece. It's a hair clip for giants. <laughs> Here we go. Man, it's like every throw. The heck we got on here? It looks like maybe some kind of washer or something. A couple scrap bits and pieces. Then we got this thing. What the heck do you think that one is? Almost looks like, is that a wheel? Like some kind of roller? You could maybe run a strap through there or something. I don't know what to think of that thing, you guys. Super rusted up, just like everything else in here. You can tell this thing's been down there forever. And then we had this thing, you guys. I don't know what to think of that either, man. Just everything is covered in so much rust. Got a little hole in the top. I don't have a clue. You guys, look at this thing I just pulled up here. That looks pretty cool, man. What do you think of that? 
some kind of like ornament piece or something i don't know it's a cool looking design on there i don't know what to think of that it's the old hat hanger boom oh look at we could hang our hat on there and we could hang our glasses now we're talking again you guys what the heck man we filled the cart all the way to the top it didn't take long at all and alex even found a gun and there's no telling what else could be out there today we are back out on the boat i got owen with me today is going to be his third video he's filming all by himself with his own gopro and today we are going to be doing some more magnet fishing back in this super old city we've already been here quite a few times all up and down this river you guys and we continue to find some crazy things all right guys today i have my large 360 degree magnet with me we are on the boat like i said and we got the finding family magnet fishing from shore if you guys would like to check out their channel i will leave the link down in the description now we're not actually gonna throw here we're gonna scoot down just a little bit there's actually a bar up this way it's right over here let's give it another shot let's start tossing around and see if we can find anything else today it is absolutely gorgeous out here today couldn't be any nicer i don't think we got like 80 degrees a little breeze Let's see what we find today. You got something already? Yeah. I think I actually might too. Literally my first throw. I think I am on something. <laughs> yup. First throw, what do we got here? Uh, looks like just a bunch of scrappy debris. Aha, uh -huh. but look at what's hidden on there. We cost the old spark plug. What the heck is that one? Bethel, Bethlehem? I never heard of that one. Psst, psst. Oh, there you go. Can you get it up? Yeah. Holy smokes. Look at that one. That's a big old pipe, huh? Yeah. Are we going to go three for three? I feel like I'm feeling stuff. I think we are going to go three for three. There must be a lot of stuff down here, you guys. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yo, what on planet earth? Do I even want to touch that? I think that's, oh, okay, it smells. I know what that is. Oh my gosh. Ooh. That was like a dead fish. Oh my gosh, that reeks. Other than the dead fish, you guys, I really don't think we got much going on here. Some kind of weird looking bracket piece and whatever the heck you want to call that covered in algae. Who knows what that thing's part of. Got it. Nice. Is that heavy? You need some help or what? Looks like a long piece. Holy cow. Oh, I'll help you. There you go. Whoa. What the heck is this, man? That's not no. Check that out. Is that maybe like the leg off of something? I don't really know. It looks like it would stand up right here. But what do you think that is? It's like the the t-shirt old 59 hanger for the shirt <laughs> you're crazy got yourself a little piece of scrap of root there who knows what the heck that thing goes to you guys some kind of frame piece off of something oh 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 land into something oh yeah that one's coming right up with us Oh yeah, what do I got here? Dude, there's some more of that white. Are you kidding me? There must just be like a, a bunch of oh, some. That is 100% like flash, man. But you guys, first of all, I don't know what this thing is. I kind of thought it looked like a crowbar at first, but that's definitely not what it is. Some kind of bracket type piece. The old shower holder bar or something. And look at this gear piece on here. We've been pulling all kinds of different toothed gear pieces out of this area. That one's just kind of a teeny tiny one. <laughs> oh, some more stuff on there. What is this? Big old washer, some kind of ring or something, bunch more nuts and bolts again, but look at this thing, man. Again, this is another something here that we've definitely found more than one of. It's like some kind of cover 
or cap type piece here. It's got like four bolts coming off the side. Again, I don't remember what this is, but I'm almost positive you guys have definitely said down in the comments. This thing is very distinctive. It's got the four pointy bolts coming off of there. Oh, here we go. Check this thing out. At first, I thought there was some more gears on there, but I don't think so. No, definitely. Or maybe those are little gears, you guys. What the heck do you think that thing is? Almost looks like an old school ashtray, except for it's got a hole in the bottom there. Well, that one is a funky looking piece. What the heck do you guys think that thing is? Ooh, look at that, man. Big old spoon hanging off of there. We got some river soup. Oh, yo. Look at this thing. Is it like a chalice or what do you call it? The old, the old drinking cup. But it doesn't really look like a like a cup or nothing i don't know it almost looks like it goes all the way down to the bottom what the heck do you think that could be take a sip out of that one oh i think i just sucked something out of the mud what the heck was that it's just about every throw in here there's so much stuff yeah here we go Check this thing out. Check this thing out, you guys. Whatever this is, is completely full of mud. I don't know what that could be, but I think, yeah, there's a hole in this side here and there's a hole in this side here. I've definitely found something like this before. I think when I had Alex with me, he said something about like, like a piston head or something. I'm pretty sure this is something off of an engine. I could be wrong, but I know for sure we pulled a couple of these out of this area already. Tons of multiples of stuff in here, you guys. A lot of different gear pieces, all kinds of stuff. I'm telling you, it's literally every throw. There is so much stuff in here. This is crazy. Oh, look what I see on the bottom. Big old pipe wrench. Check that out. What is that? It's a pen. A pen? Oh yeah, what the heck is that? That's not, that's no pen, but that's just, that's not just a regular piece of scrap metal either. I don't know what you would call it. Almost looks like carbide or something. It's a weird looking pin type piece. Got a little hole in the bottom. You guys, we got a couple things on here. Super old pipe wrench. What the heck you think they were using this one for? And what the heck is this? It almost looked like some kind of mini ball hitch or something at first, or maybe a nut and bolt. But if you look real close, there's definitely teeth on there. There's some kind of gears on there. Again, another weird looking gear piece. What the heck do you think these things are coming off of? Whoa, look at this. What is that? Oh, that's definitely the foot off of something. Maybe an old coffee table. That would be my guess. That's definitely the foot off of something. Or maybe an old end table. Who really knows? And I wonder if it's still down there. Pretty cool. Here we go. I see a bunch of bubbles coming up here. Ooh. Oh yeah. That's heavy. What is this? I got it. Heck yeah. Oh, 
grenade. Ooh, a couple things. You caught a grenade. Oh, it's a, it looks like a grenade, doesn't it? Oh, it says we caught us a grenade. Everybody run. You guys, we caught a whole bunch of stuff, but first of all, check this thing out. I don't know what to think of this. Something with some kind of shaft on there. I don't know what to think of that, you guys. Look at that. This part here almost looks like the tip of a drill, maybe like you could loosen this and tighten it up and put like a drill in there like a drill bit i don't know that's a weird one look at what owen just caught you guys i caught one of those and now you just caught one owen just found another one of the exact same type of cover things that got the four bolts coming out the side huh and we had a bunch else on here maybe some kind of washer or something this right here looks 100 like a window weight to me you guys yep you can see the hole in the top there i don't know exactly how these were used or how they work all i know is that this is 100 percent called a window weight huh then we had some kind of white thing on there the old marshmallow on a nail what the heck is that it almost looks like that ceramic material or something it's kind of like glass it's like a piece of glass on a nail i don't really know what to think of that but you guys look at this thing this was what I thought looked like one of the cooler things on the magnet this throw. Definitely some little itty bitty teeth or gears on there. It almost looks to me like the internals of possibly a clock or something. I don't know, man. What do you guys think that is? Something with the little teeth on there. Pretty cool. Oh, something again. There is so much stuff in here, it's crazy. That feels a little heavier. Like way heavier. What the heck is that? Whoa. What in the... Holy smokes. Oh, you know what I think this is? Holy cow, I bet you this is an old fire pit ring. <laughs> I could snap this right in half, watch. Wow, that thing's old, my goodness. Ooh. Oh, look at, first of all, I can see another spark plug on there. Oh, look at, ooh, caught me the old murder butter knife. I could snap it. Oh yeah, for sure. That thing is so flimsy. You guys, handles still on there and everything, man. Look at all that rust. I don't know if I buttered your bread with that one. Oh, that's heavy. What is this? You need help? No, I got it. Whoa, dude. Yo, that looks super cool, actually. Hold on a second. What the heck is that? Almost looks like, again, maybe some more teeth or something in there. That thing's pretty heavy, you guys. I've never seen anything like that before, but th this here definitely looks like some kind of nozzle. I don't know, you guys. That's a really weird looking something. It's in the same area. Oh, I got something. Hold on, I'll help you in a second. You stuck? Are you on something? I got something here. Oh, look at that, it caught me the old hammerhead. Missing the whole handle on that sucker. You ain't building no house yet with that one. This thing had to be down there forever. And look at, you can see how it was like, it must've been sitting in the mud, just like that. That's pretty cool. Stuck, let's see. See what you got here. Oh, oh, I think you're on something, dude. You got something heavy with this magnet. I just couldn't lift it. Wow, I don't even feel like this magnet should be lifting this. Actually, hold on. <laughs> what is this, dude? It's coming up though. Whoa, what is that? Oh my gosh, that's a big old pipe piece. Or some kind of, is that like the base of a bird bath or something? <laughs> Look at this thing. I'm surprised that magnet even pulled this up. Oh my gosh. I don't know, man. Looks like a big old pipe or something. The bottom base here is a little thicker, but uh, I don't know, nothing too fancy there. What is that? Holy cow, what is that? Oh, get it, get it, get, get it. it up. Oh, oh. 
Oh, dude, you know what that is? What? You caught a cast iron pan. Nice. Missing a handle. I don't know if that's what was supposed to go here or what, but check that out. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Got cookie some eggs in that one. Yep, yeah, gotta cook up some river eggs. <laughs> some river eggs. Here we go. I'm dragging something. You got something too? Yep. Oh, we're doubled up. Let's see, if we can make it Let's see what we get. Oh, mine's pretty heavy. Oh my goodness. That is pretty heavy. Oh, what the? Yo! Oh, dude. Look at, first of all, look at this massive wrench sticking off of there. Oh my gosh. Now that's the Mac Daddy wrench. What is that for? Like opening fire hydrants or something? That's pretty cool, you guys. And honestly, even for as old and rusty as this looks, all you really got to do is clean out this inside here and you could still use this. The old two-hander wrench. But you guys, I seen a big old chunk of glass in there pinched in what looks like just a bunch of scrap. Oh, what's this? No, I got me a pliers. I almost didn't even see that. Ah, oh, but look, it's like the needle nose pliers, but one of the noses is broken. Well, you definitely ain't fixing that one no more. Still pretty cool though. And other than the bunch of debris and the glass piece that I see here, I see yet again another handle. And this one looks just like the other ones. It's got to be off of some kind of small chest or trunk or something. Or maybe a dresser. Who really knows? Huh. Oh, there's something heavy all of a sudden. Oh, uh, yeah. Whoa, this might be the heaviest thing I've had on all day so far. I'm not kidding. Nice and slow here. Oh, there's a couple things. Yo. Oh, buddy, I don't want to lose none of them. Oh, here we go. What the heck is going on here, dude? Couple things. Oh, my goodness. Look at We're dumping water all over the boat. You guys, look at this thing. It's like some kind of triangular... Looks like a box shape almost. And look at this, there's like a hinge on there. What on earth is this thing? This doesn't have teeth on it. No teeth on there, no gears on there. Huh, it must just be a big old washer. Check that one out. Oh, and count himself the big old washeroo. I can't really tell, man. I don't know what this could be. Super weird. But we also had a couple other things and this right here, I kid you not. The very last time we were here was me and Alex and I found another one of these things. And if I'm correct, I thought he said it was something like an exhaust manifold or something like that. So again, like some more vehicle parts. I really wonder what this building used to be. We could play us the trumpet. <laughs> Oh, what is that on there? Look at that. Oh, look at, I know exactly what this is. You can tell this is like the, like a lid for a pot or something. It's got like a little knob handle on there. My gosh, man. There gotta be two inches of rust on just about everything we're pulling out of here. And this is just the lid. I wonder if the rest of the pot is down there somewhere. It's like, it's like fishing line. Oh, that's like wire or something. Look at that. That's definitely like copper wire on there or something. Check that it's out. Like a, also a string that I can fold on. Oh, what to think of that one? Check out this one that Owen found you guys. Definitely like some copper wire or something, or maybe not copper, but some kind of wire wrapped on what looks like a bolt. What do you think that thing could be? Some kind of homemade something? Maybe somebody's sinker? I don't know. Oh! <gasps> Yo, oh my gosh. Is that the bell? There's something glass. And it was like caught because there's a couple metal pieces in there. Yo, what is this, dude? That looks super cool. Some kind of glass 
cover for something like a light maybe i don't really know man it's a little chipped on the side there but not too bad i don't see any writing i don't know what this could be i almost feel like i shouldn't break it but i don't know what it is Oh, that's heavy. Yeah, I feel like we could just come here for days and days and just keep pulling stuff out. You guys, look at this. What is this? Some kind of pipe or something? Again, a little bit of plumbing. Nothing too fancy, but look at this. That's kind of cool looking. I don't even know what to think of that. Maybe a super fancy fishing pole holder or like a, or maybe an oar holder i don't really know that is a super cool piece you guys i just can't get over how much cool stuff we're finding all along this entire shoreline you guys absolutely unbelievable we've been out here for a couple hours scorching in the sun and it paid off we filled up this entire cart and once again with some seriously cool stuff i got this Hi guys. I, I want me some ice cream. I didn't know where we were going, but Harry Queen. Thank you. Ready? Heck yeah, we got some ice cream now, huh? Yep. This is pretty nice on a hot day. Ooh, that looks pretty yummy, huh? Did you hear that tweaking? Yeah. You see those little holes in the nest Yeah. You know what those nests are? What? Little bird's nests up under there? Yeah. Yeah. They put their babies in there. Tweet, 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 tweet. All right, you guys, we are packed up and off the river. Today was an absolute scorcher. Owen's already sitting in the truck catching some air. But you guys, another absolutely crazy day out there on the river. We filled the cart right up and again with tons of cool old stuff. Look at the back of my truck, you guys. That sucker is about to touch the ground. It is absolutely gorgeous out here. The sun is shining. We already got the boat in the river. As you can see, Alex is sitting over there. Today, we are going to be doing some more magnet fishing right behind the bar that we've been hitting previously. You guys, we have been finding some seriously crazy stuff out here. Everything from guns to drug bags, you name it. All right, you guys, today we are back out here once again. I have my large 360 degree magnet with me. And once again, we are going to be starting off behind this bar and this old white building that we still don't really know what it used to be back in the day. We're going to start poking around in this area. If we don't find much, we might move up and down the shoreline here, but I almost guarantee you we're going to fill this cart from here to the bar just in this small section. So let's get right down to it, start tossing around and see what we can find here today. Here we go. I am already dragging something, you guys. Off to a good start right off the bat. This is my second throw here. Throw number two, what do she do? Uh, a lot of fishing line tangled up in there. Looks like just a bunch of scrap, you guys. A whole lot of fishing line, but I don't see a fishing lure. Looks like just a bunch of junk and debris, you guys. And then maybe some kind of funky looking hook piece look at that i don't know what the heck you want to call that the old oven rack grabber or something's got a little hook on there Whoa, grab the oven rack and pull it out without burning yourself i have no clue oh i'm feeling something already here like back to back right off the bat here or maybe not oh look what is that piece of paper it's a love note it's a sos letter it fell out of the bottle. Oh, orange handle. Yo, check it out, you guys. I caught me the old flat tip screwdriver. Heck yeah, that's like a decent one yet. You could go screwing. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, what is this here? 
Look at that. Uh, it almost looks like some kind of bolt lock or something, you guys. Look at the little tab on the end there. Maybe there's supposed to be a chain on there, and this is part of a bolt lock for a door. I don't really know. What the heck do you think that one is? Oh, hold on a second. We got some writing on there. Ooh, what does that say? I'm sure it's kind of hard to see this here, but it looks like there's some writing on the bottom here, guys. It's starting to show up a lot better once it dries out. It looks like it says John Chatillion and Sons or something. Makers New York USA. And then it says not legal for use in trade. What the heck do you think that is? Oh, look at this one here. Some kind of wire with the clamps on there, you guys. Look at that, it's almost like a ground wire or something, because you can see the this part there and that part there. That is definitely what that is. What do you think that one came off of? Ground cable. You need to be grounded? You need to get us some of those right there. Oh, what is that? Bingo, Flamingo. What the heck is this, you guys? Oh, you know what this is, dude? This is a tube of uh, caulk or something. You can see the tip on there. Holy cow, it almost looks like it was not even opened or something. There hasn't been one thing that I pulled out of here yet that looks like it was new. Look at all the gunk on there. Oh, look at this. Hold on. A couple nuts and bolts, of course. Maybe a little washer. Some more scrap metal. But look at this thing, you guys. That's kind of cool looking. Looks like some sort of hook. And it's got like three little brackets like it could bracket onto something. Oh, I know what this was used for. Boom, baby. It's the old hat hanger. Heck yeah. Definitely not a fish hook, that's for sure. Huh, who knows? What? Is that a sign? Oh, oh, oh my gosh, it is. No way, yo. <laughs> He's freaking out. Dude, no way. That's cool, yo. You guys, look at this. Alex found an entire stop sign. What a find. Oh, what the heck is that? Wait a minute, first I thought this was just some kind of, like a, I don't even know, like a bracket type piece, but there's, I don't know what the heck's going on there. Look at that, you guys. That's a weird looking something. You could maybe slide some kind of cylinder in there. I don't even know. There is some weird stuff in here. Oh, I got something way out here. Heck yeah. Ooh, that's, that's kind of heavy actually. Ooh, I like me some heavy stuff. How do I do? Rope string. Oh, yo, I caught me a clam. We fishing for clams, baby. Look at, oh, it's all full of mud. No pearl, we're not getting rich today. But you guys, check this out. Couple things going on here. First of all, we got a, some kind of funky looking hook here. And I wanna say, again, this is something that we've already pulled out of here. Tons of multiples of stuff in this area, you guys. And then this thing with the string hanging off of it. What the heck do you think that is? It almost looks like a giant homemade sinker, you guys. Yeah, look at, you can see the, the fishing um, gear on there, like the clip and the swivel. We cost the old homemade anchor. Check that one out. guys look at that oh my goodness it's not even broken it's not cracked or nothing and we caught it because there's like a 
a metal wire around it. You guys, this is like an, some kind of insulator. Oh, look at right there. It says Brookfield on the glass. Holy cow. It's got a B on the top. Dude, that's super cool, man. I know for a fact these are collectible and definitely worth money. Look at this. That is so cool. something something down there i'm pulling real slow i don't want this to fall off oh oh no 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 we're slipping come here what is this oh man is it an ugly oh yo ah! <laughs> dude I thought it was just a pipe or something, but you guys, look it. I caught me an entire umbrella. Is that the American flag umbrella? That's what it looks like. Oh my gosh. Ah. Holy cow, look at it. It's wrapped up yet and everything. Is there a body in there or something? Oh. I don't know. <laughs> Unreal, you guys. Honestly, I'd be willing to bet there's probably a couple crayfish buddies tucked up in there. Unbelievable, you guys. I caught me a whole umbrella. There is some seriously wild stuff in here. Oh, look at that. I thought we just had a bunch of debris, you guys. But look at that spoon. I think this is the first spoon ever made in, in history. How old do you guys seriously think that is? Look at that. I mean, I could snap that so quick, just like that. My goodness. <laughs> you ain't eating no river soup with that one. Oh, stuck something way out here. Oh, that's heavy. Oh, that's really heavy. What the heck is this? Ooh. Oh my gosh, why is that seriously so heavy? Oh, look at what else is jammed up in there too, you guys. I got me the old screwdriver and no way. Look at this one's a Phillips head. You gotta be kidding me, you guys. Look at that. Now I got me the flat tip and the Phillips. We're going screwing for real now. But you guys, we had this big old block. I don't know what this is. It looks like there's a little hole in there. Otherwise this side's kind of rounded. I don't know. It's a landmine or something. I think I might have just like landed straight on something because I'm already pulling something. <laughs> yep. What do we got here? It is just non stop, you guys. Man, it's nice out today, too. Oh, look it. Look at, I picked it up full of water too. Ha, 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 ha. We could dip our hands in there, wash up a little bit. <laughs> you guys, unreal. I found me an old bucket and I'm talking old, buddy. Look at that sucker. I don't even think you could, oh, shut up. We can move the handle. We got a bucket for real, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Unreal, you guys. Now we can use this with our spoon. We can cook us up some river soup. Oh, look at there's bugs in there too. We got some bug flavor. A little bit of crunch to our soup. This is like one of my favorite things about this area, you guys. Just the different variety of cool stuff. You don't know if you're gonna find a, a gun or a bucket or a stop sign. You just never know. And I almost wonder if something like this might have a marking on the bottom. Super cool, you guys. Oh, that's a little something. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, yes, ma'am. What do we got this time? Ooh, oh, a couple things on there. First of all, some kind of cover looking piece with the little tab on there. What do you guys think that used to cover? I don't know, man, but that thing looks super, yeah, I mean, look at how brittle that is. No doubt that thing's been down there forever. 
And then check this thing out. What the heck do you guys think that thing is? This again looks like something from an engine. What do you think? I bet you you know a what that is. Rod. What is it? Connecting rod. A connecting rod. I figured you'd know what that is. It looks like something for an this engine. This goes down to your crank shaft, which is your cam shaft is up here. So this is your piston head going up and down like that. So your valves too, it's all working together. Huh, that's crazy. Oh, look at that, you guys. Bunch of debris and junk on there. But check out that fishing lure. I forget what the heck the name of these are, but look at the hooks on there. Holy cow. Fishing lures are some of the best finds, you guys, because no matter how old or junky they look, you can always clean them up, replace the hooks, and they'll be good to go. Look at that one, the old white something with the red eye. Looks like it was sitting in the mud just like that for quite a while. <laughs> fall off i think we just snatched something pull the old snatcheroo up out of the mud holy tangled up mess here buddy what the heck is this bunch of fishing line bunch of debris that's just about every throw there but you guys hold on a second if i can get this fishing line off check this out it almost looks like some kind of old school vice or something. I don't know, dude, I've never seen nothing like that before. I don't know what to think of this thing, you guys. The old golden something here, that is pretty cool looking. It's like medieval. It's got a pointy something with a, I don't even know. I just, I, that is really weird looking, you guys. What the heck do you think of that? Ooh, something on there. Oh, bingo flamingo. Check it out, you guys. We got us a, a hammerhead. Look at that. There's like hardly even any of the handle left on there. She's dwindled right down. If you take this along with all the hundred million thousand nails we're finding in here, we could build us a house. Ting, 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 tong. Something here. Oh, what is that, yo? Oh, is that another pot? Look at that, I can't really tell what the heck this is. Almost looks like some kind of pot again. Hey! Any luck out there? Is it? Forget what you call these, not the rattle trap. That's what they are, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did there used to be an automotive shop here back in the day, do you know? Across the road. Is it? Yeah. Because it's holy cow, all kinds of pistons and. Camp shop like this long, like a big old camp. All shop. kinds of stuff. Oh, yo, what is this? You guys, <laughs> what do you think this is? That looks really cool, man. There's like some bolts on there. I don't know what the heck this is, but it looks like maybe something kind of snapped off, like something, I don't know. I don't even have a clue. I don't know what this is, you guys, but if you look underneath all the rust here, it's like a shiny black, almost like it's painted. What the heck could that be? That's a really weird one, man. That got heavier. Whoa. Oh, yo! Dude, I know what this is right off the bat because I can see the handles on here. Yup, look at this is some kind of hand drill. Like an old school hand drill. No way. You guys, I don't know what happened to the, I don't know if the drill bit 
tips there are like replaceable kind of looks like it i wonder what do they use these for drilling holes in like in wood or metal or what i guess whatever you want probably super cool you guys the old hand cranker we could drill us some holes What the heck? I almost didn't even think this was anything, you guys. It looks like a little golden canister or something, but I just crushed it because it looks super brittle. And look at the inside here. There's like a, literally a spring in there. What in the world do you think that was? I, there's nothing else in there, just like a nail with a spring. And it was in a closed container. What the heck? The old underwater jack in the box, boing. Boom, that's something. Got quite a bit of weight too. Holy stuff on that one. Oh, look at what's sticking right off of the top, you guys. We cost a little bitty wrench. Looks like a whole bunch of stuff on here. That thing is super tiny though. Look at that, fits in my hand. Other than that, you guys, doesn't look like nothing too crazy. Just a bunch of nuts, bolts, and a whole bunch of debris, but I do see this funky looking thing here. Almost looks like, again, some kind of coil wrapped on there. I don't know. Look at that funky little mechanism. Ooh, something in the mud there. And it wants to come up. Oh, it's going to... Ooh. Ooh. That feels good. I love it when we get some weight. Even though I love it. Heck yeah, dude. Look at, Look at that. That's definitely some kind of wheel, but like, what the heck do you think that's for? Maybe an old wagon? Yeah, look, you can see the gears on there. Ah, that's super cool, you guys. It almost looks like an old train car wheel or something. It's like flat. All kinds of different really cool stuff coming out of here. Oh, 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 stepping on the rope. I don't like when I do that because it doesn't go far, but every time I do that, I seem to find some good juicy stuff. So let's see if the old stepping on the rope throw pays off or not. Oh, dude, hit something for a second. Right there, we're on something, but it's kind of stuck in the mud. We gotta play the wiggle game. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Hoo, 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 hoo. Come on, come on. Oh, it's coming. Oh yes, dude. Oh no, no, we're slipping. What could this be? Is it gonna come up? Yes, I got it. Here it comes, dude. That was in the mud good and it's heavy. What is this? Oh, whoa. What did you say? Leaf spring. A leaf spring? That's a tiny one. Which I know for sure I've caught leaf springs in the past, but I'm pretty sure they're way bigger than this one. This one's pretty small. That's pretty crazy, you guys. Some more automotive evidence here. Oh, that actually might be something. Maybe not. I don't know what that just happened there. Oh yeah, something on there, you guys. Look at this thing. Oh, wait a minute, what the? Listen. What the heck, is there something in there? Or what is this? Is that just loose? I don't know what's going on there, guys, but definitely something loose in there. What the heck do you think that one could be? Oh, a little bit of red and white. What the heck is that? We got us a pen. Check it out. We got the Northport Motors 2. There you go. See, see Gary or Judy. Oh, 
That's something there. Pulling from some different angles here. Ah, what do we got here? Check that one out, you guys. What the heck do you think of that? Is that like the old ore holder? I highly doubt it. I don't know what to think of that thing. The old, what the heck is that, man? Oh, I got something heavy here. Yeah, that sucker's real heavy from the depths below. What the heck is going on here? First of all, look at bingo. We got us another file, you guys. That makes file number two. But check this thing out. I don't know what the heck you want to think of this one. Got a couple holes in it there like it would uh, bolt onto something. And it looks like the rest is broke off. The old crayfish hotel, but nobody's home. Oh, that's something heavy. Heck yeah, that's actually really heavy. Oh boy, what is this? Whoa. Nah, -uh. it's another one of them long barred things that I thought was just like a whole bunch of nothing, you guys. I said they had like a handle on it, but uh, the end of it's got like a split. This is now the second one. Yeah, right here. Now I got two of these. What the heck do you think these are coming from? That's pretty funky. And there was a something else funky on here. Looks like we got a little, maybe a door hinge or something there. But look at this one, man. What the heck do you think that is? Look at this dude. It's got like a, like a, I don't even know, like a diamond shape, like a, that's weird. What do you guys think that is? Looks like it goes on to something there, but who knows what. Based on all the other stuff we're pulling out of here, you guys, I can only guess something automotive. Oh, I think I'm hitting on some stuff here. That's pretty heavy. Oh, yeah, buddy. Ooh, what the? Dude, no. Really, another one of what I think is a spark plug. Holy cow. These are some seriously old ones. I can't even tell what that one says. But we had this big old thing on there. What the heck you guys think this one is? Again, looks like some more gear tight teeth on there i don't know there's there's so many things in here with different gears and speaking of gears alex just pulled this one out and look at that some more gears on there you guys check this out of course my gopro dies as i pull this up we caught us the old shoe here and i'm pretty sure i stuck to like the nails in the heel what size do you think we got oh a little bit smaller than me probably about a 10. Oh, yo, look at the handle sticking off of that one. I have never seen a player's that long in my entire life. That sucker's long, dude. Look at that. It's like the size of my forearm. Could really pick some boogers with this one. Unreal, you guys. There is so much cool stuff coming out of here. And even with all this rust on here, I bet you you can still get this working again. Good there, right there. Oh, look at this. Dude, this is another one of them, what I think is like a homemade sinker. Yeah, you can see it's got a swivel on there and a bunch of like fishing gear. It's got the fishing clip with the fishing swivel. That's part of the satellite. Is it? This is like the second or third one I found in here. Holy cow. So check this one out, you guys. They're saying this is like a set line sinker. Shut up. Heck yeah, dude. No way. You caught a long handled one compared to mine, dude. That's way cool. Check out this hand drill that Alex found. It's almost the same kind of style as the one that I found here, only his is like super long. It's got the extender piece on there. Yep, same kind of deal here too. Er
because you know water. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, how long do you think you guys go? Oh, we've been out here since this morning. This is our second trip. Mm -hmm. Is it? Yeah. 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 Yeah, I see you guys doing this. We've been doing this for about a year on this river anyways. What do you guys do with all? Just most of it just goes to the scrapyard. Just scrap it. If we find some cool stuff, we'll keep it and restore it. We got YouTube channels where we restore oh, stuff you? on. Oh, yeah, so yeah. Nice. Cool. Yeah. Well, you guys got light jackets and everything? Yeah. Well, we have a space. Yeah. Any, any questions for me at all? No. You got any questions for me? No. No. No, no. All right. Thanks. Have a good one. Holy smokes, you guys. I am absolutely roasted. My truck right now says it's 92 degrees outside. Yet again, you guys, another seriously crazy day. There is so much crazy stuff out there, you guys, and all of it is super old. I don't think we found anything newish, but that is going to wrap it up for today, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. If you enjoyed this video today, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me and don't forget to subscribe, guys. Make sure to stay tuned and I will catch you on the next one.